Uh, we're finally here, we finally made it. Welcome to the Port Douglas Open. Two days of great golf and day one, Palmer Sea Golf Course. It's lovely, it's a couple of saltwater crocodiles out there. Um, let's get around to a couple of big salties as well. Big salty number one, Jack Gojefsky. How are you feeling, big fella? I'm a bit dusty, but I'm simply here just to hit birdies. Birdies only. Um, what's your favorite part about golf? Um, I don't know, to be honest, but I'm a bit nervous about slicing into the crocs, but <laughs> the course is looking really good. Um, the weather's not too bad. And here for a good time. If you had one goal today, what would it be? I want over 30 points to be honest, but I've got the yips, so there I'm you, struggling. There you go, he wants over 30. Right, uh, come on to the, uh, we'll say the uh, the roughy. Late inclusion. Mate, Rubes, yep. you excited about this morning? I'm keen, I'm ready to go. A bit dusty, but we're here. Are you confident? Uh, I don't know about confident. I'm ready to go. My handicap will look after me, I reckon, but just got to hit fairway. And we're finding out just one goal for today on the 18 holes. What would your goal be? Um, Double bogeys. He gets two shots of holes, so that's two, two points. Points, hole, he'll so take that. If I get a double bogey every hole, I'll be laughing at the end of it. Here we go. That's, that's salty number two. What are your thoughts about the shoes? They're nice, eh? Hey? Jordans. Jordan golf shoes. Here he is a death rider himself. Can't do that, mate. No practicing. Shall I say you're going to play out of the bunker? He's got the pants on. It's a bold move, Cotton. See if it pays off. <laughs> All right, Tommy Dearden, get over here. Oh, we just want to find uh, what's your one and only goal for this 18 holes? I'd say probably my goal is to hit 36 points, but um, other than that, I just want to enjoy the round. Yeah. Looks like it's going to be a good day. Hopefully see a saltwater crocodile on the course. There's a couple of big salties over there now. Thanks, Tommy. Let's go check out Valentine Holmes. Pants have just been recently tapered in, fitting nicely. We've got some nice shoes on, but you know we're just finding out You know, one goal <coughs> for this 18 holes. What would your goal be? Mate, just hit fairways. Yep. Fairways and greens, that's all I do. Green and rigger? Yeah, bros. There you have it. And let's go find out what the biggest salty for more wants to do today. Here he is, 112 kilos do your best we're just trying to find out you know what's i think i know what it will be but what's your goal for today my goal is to have enough points at the turn so that i don't go into the clubhouse and buy myself a six pack <laughs> six pack of what four x gold here he is big griff big griff playing off 26 i don't know how i feel about that 27 don't know how i feel about that but what are you 108 109 keg that would oh, look at the ball up there Sorry about it. all right we have um we were just trying to find out you know what would what's your one and only goal for this 18 holes. Me? Um, well, I didn't pack too many balls, so I heard there's um, some water on each hole, so um, hopefully staying out of the drink. <laughs> as much as out of the can. Scott drink he wants. You're yeah, not many balls. Well, there's a clubhouse up there and you can go purchase some balls, you told us. I'm here with the uh, probably the favourite of the trip at the moment, um, Mr. Consistent, Chatty Townsville. Um, what's your goal uh, for, for this 18 holes? 36, no three putts. That's my goal, just today. That's a good one, no three putts. You don't want a three putt. And my only goal is today, I don't want to go home clean. No washes. I want to be dirty over 18. Pardon me, Griff. Righto, we're going to go to the first tee off. I'm up first. Pressure's on. Oh, it's in the bunk. It's over the pot. Holy, oh, in the twirl. In the club twirl. Oh, it's in the pot. Oh, the 10th. Oh. Oh. Nice, nice mud. Yeah, that'll little play. baby fade. That'll play. Oh, yeah, mud. Nice. That'll play. Oh, he's showing teeth. <laughs> oh, <laughs> he didn't want to do it. Look, look, he's doing it. Look, he's doing it. He didn't want to do it. It ain't slow, it's just tempo, boys. <laughs> oh, 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 Jesus. Go on, lads, you go. That's a pill. Yeah, not bad. Didn't get on it that well. Talk to it. Hit it pure. I'm the furthest. Scotty's hit a bit of a draw. Gryffindor, bit of a draw. Mud up the guts. Great start. Great start. Oh, 
Three, 138, the big salty one, the pitch and wedge. My God, get in the, oh, but get in the hole. That is something. Great golf. Oh, shot, Griff. We're at the halfway mark. Give us a bit of a score update, Mud. Uh, on 16 points. Yeah, probably had a few bogeys that let me down. 20, yeah. Jack's on 19. I'm on 16. You're leading the group at the moment. Off a 27 handicap, though. I don't make the rules Absolute up, burger. At the turn, Chatty. 12. Maybe. Groups, 18. Wow, at the, at the turn, how are we? 20 points. Not bad. Not bad. Hess. Drums. Where's Nick Wong? with there, big fella. Front nine, I hit 20. Back nine, 12, 32. Not too bad for 27 oh, handicap. Oh, mate. It's a bit of a GR. I don't make the rules, mate. All right, before I go over here, this is how this person's feeling. <laughs> Not What'd you get in the back there, mate? 19 points on the front. Come into the turn, had a coffee and a bit of water. Went out the back, went wipe, wipe, wipe. <laughs> one point, one point, one point. Wipe. Two points. Two points. Two points. Finish with seven on the back. <laughs> points on the back. Thanks for coming. More or less the same as the front line, just wow. making bogey. Started the day with the par, ended with the par. Everything, yeah. everything in between was just bogeys and one point and ticking away. I'm going home. Dirty. I'm going home dirty, but. That's uh, good. That was my goal. No Didn't washes. happen. And I finished on 30 points as well. Same as Mud. So Griff's got two points on us. Hopefully I'm in the first cart tomorrow, but don't think it will be. Is that a shout? Is that a shout from Val Ives? Righto, oh, so we just finished 18. No, I think it should be in. Um, it? Some good golf, favourites, didn't go too great. So we go starting from the top. Val's on 35 points. Rubes, 33, off 36 handicap. Griffin, another burglar, 32 points off 27 handicap. Mud, 30, we've got me in here, but Drinky, 30 as well. Um, Cowan Hess, 26. Big Ski, Violet Crumble, 26. With 20, 19 on the front, you do the math. And Chatty, the favourite, 25. Bit of work to do there, big fella, 10 points behind. Could be driving the bus home. See you tomorrow. Righto, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. That's what we've all been waiting for. It's day two, it's finals day. We're at the Mirage Country Club. Let's go get around a few of the fells and see uh, who their favourite is for the day. Righto, Cohen, your playing partner today. What'd you score yesterday? 27 points, so pretty, pretty far away from the leaders, but confident I can still make a comeback. Who's, who's your money on other than yourself? Before we come, Ruben, Ruben Cotter, I played around with him and I thought his handicap should be 67. He's playing off 36 today and he, and he went well yesterday. Um, he only needs a double bogey for two points, and he was pretty consistent at those, so a um, bit of a smoky. He, he was about $151 before the trip, and, and today he's starting at $7. I do love me pun, so I'm a punning man. So, um, Ruben Cotter at sevens. Ruben Cotter at sevens. Thanks for your time, big fella. Here we go. V Violet Crumble himself. Jet ski. Uh, mate, yesterday would be hit. I ended up with 20, 25 points, but had 19 on the front. Went three wipes in a row straight off the back <laughs> and fought really hard. Uh, just to get <laughs> just to get seven points. <laughs> All right. Um, other than yourself, who would your money be on today? Um, I want one of the roughies. I'd, I want Griff to take it out. I think it'll hurt hurt less if it's not a great golfer that gets the win. Thank you. Thanks for your time, big fella. Good luck. Come on, we're gonna go find a big salty. Big Griff, saltwater croc, Neem. A couple of salties actually out in that water out there, <coughs> mate. Pretty good performance yesterday. Thirty-two points. I reckon you'd be the underdog. Who would your money be on if it? Not yourself. If it wasn't myself. Yeah. Um, Val's leading, so I've got a bit of work to catch up. A few points ahead, but I think if he plays some good golf, he's going to be hard to catch. Thank you, Griffin. Oh, actually, we'll leave the fact, we'll leave the winner to the last. Ruben Cotter. Ruben, come out here, Rubes. Come out here. Well, what a performance it was yesterday. Yeah. Just give me a little bit of insight to the confidence today after yesterday's performance. Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm sitting pretty high. 
took a lot of confidence out of yesterday, so just got to do the same thing today, stay relaxed and, hit, and hit, hit them straight. Just hit double bogeys and he gets yeah, two points. Bogeys. Who's your money on, other than yourself? Um, I'd like to see Big Riff. Big Riff go alright today. The Big Salty. The Big Salty, Salty number three. The biggest Salty. Tommy Dearden, he's going back to the OG kit, the pink kit. Yeah. Mate, wow. in group one today, who's your money on, other than yourself? Well, I think um, Val's got a pretty handy lead, but he, he might have a violet in him, so we're just probably got to make sure that we, we stick there by him and wait for that to happen and then we can chase him down. Val, other than yourself, you're leading it. He's the leader at the moment. Um, three points clear of next best, Ruben Cotter. Who's your money on other than yourself? It's certainly not on the pig over here. I think he'd be driving home. But if there was someone, a roughie, I think my partner, Ruben. But I'll be into him all day. <laughs> Diamond in the rough. And my money for today is on Mr Cotter. I'm going to go Ruben Cotter for the win. You Just do, anyone but Val. My money, look, I reckon Val holds holds the lead. Um, turns up when it matters and I reckon he holds on and wins. No, I don't want Val to win. Oh, could be safe. Might be alright. Be alright. Any teeth? One a day. Alright boys, did them well. Did them well. Go Rubes. Into them Rubes. Quick little update here, just to see. <laughs> the ski. This is the ski. I've come off that tree over there. <laughs> and the little halfbacks up here in front of him. So we are nine holes in on day two. Not very good golf being played at the moment in group two. I'm on nine points, which is absolute garbage. God, struggling. Drinky's on 12, Jet Ski's on 12, and Hesse's on 12. We're just waiting for the other boys there in the other group because they have the better scores. Then we're going to see who is, who's got the best scores because it's combined from yesterday, and then we're going to put them in the second group, and then the first group will go first. I'm fighting to get in this first group. I'm hoping Mud had a shocking round, worse than 12. I want to be in that first group. I'm sick of playing with this custard. We're death riding the other group. Bad, <laughs> but we are struggling. <laughs> Over and out. Thoughts? Cohen. Boss <laughs> drove. Rat in the coffin. I'm a big fan of a rat in the coffin. Rat in the coffin. <laughs> I'm a rat in the coffin. I'll get a rat in the coffin. If you're, if you're going to the halfway house, you're going A, rat in the coffin, B, dog's on. <laughs> I want to know what's going through the head. I'm in absolute shambles and I don't want to drive the bus home. <laughs> <laughs> so this back to mine. It's going to be on for young and old because there's a big, what, four points. Four points between me and Chad, one point between me and Hesse. Mud's like this the whole way. Mud's like this the whole way. Mud is, what is it? Mud is on four. He's, He's one over. He is on <laughs> No way! What are you doing? Like 20 for the point. Uh, 14 and then 11. Wow. What's that take you to? 44. Oh! What are you just Wow. <laughs> we have got Who's 12 going? and Chad's wow. I got 9, I got 9. What are you on? Where's Greer? I got 8. 8, 8, 8. Oh, what are you on? 14. Mud, how many points are you on? Oh. Oh. So is there any changes? 12. Three three on, two. Two. No changes. Oh, He's playing the best golf we've ever seen him play. Mate. I had a bit of movement in the leaderboard um, at the turn, so I'll, I'll start from 8th actually, it was the um, pre-tournament favourite Chad Townsville, um, 34 points. The jet skis in 7th, 38, myself, 39, Drinky, 42, Rubes, 44, the pig, he, he's, he's folded under a bit of pressure, he's down to 48, Big Griffo, Dark Horse, 50, and the new leader, the teeth. <laughs> 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 so he's been hitting pars and showing teeth. Like the same. same. Eagle part opportunity for the ski. Nah. Oh, ski for bird. Ski. Oh.
asshole of the trip. I've fought hard to not have to drive, but I've absolutely butchered a lot. Like three Wait, nine. What do you? What, how many points are you on total? He's on eight. I, I've got eight. On the back. So I'm on twenty. So I'm on forty-seven. So I'm on forty. Changing club. I think I'm on forty-seven too. Yeah, we need it. We need a. Spin. We need a bit of drama on the last hole. We've tossed up nothing else. I'm on forty-eight. Oh yeah. And 48. what are you, Hesse? Forty-seven, 47. Hesse. This is good. I'm going first. What a boy. I'd be a bit bored that. Yeah, you've you hit that five parts in a row. So I'm one point in front of Hesse. Where he's uh, fighting for last, last second head. last place. <laughs> you so, both have a shot here, or both don't. We both have a shot. Okay, both no, have, we don't. It's eleven. So he's both don't have a shot here. This so is insane. This is going to decide who's driving home five hours. How do you feel? Sweet. I love the pressure. He's up. He's just whistled one in there. That long? That's on the D floor. Back of the D floor? Yeah, yeah it's good. He's nearly pin high. He can't putt though. <laughs> nearly pin high. He's going to be happy with it. He was just on that green there for two yeah. and four putted for a double bogey. A bit of pressure here, Chatty. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh oh, short. Oh! <laughs> you, oh a, my is that god! A door has just opened. Hell. A door has just opened. Oh no. You're telling me there's a chance? Holy. Forgot. 139, 139. Oh, I hit an 8 on. Because yeah. look at the, the wind, it's in the wind and it's uphill. That sounded thin. That's in the club. That's in the club. <laughs> <laughs> That's in the club. <laughs> It's in the club, yeah. That's in the club. Oh, that's a bullet. It's all to it, Scott. This, this is par for Hesse for how many, what, two points? I think you got to get two. So you got a four. So you, you got, got a what? Four. You can get a five and you're tired. No, but then I'd win on a count back. <laughs> nah, we'll play it again. <laughs> yeah, Chatty, you got to pump this in, Chatty. What, so he needs this to not drive home? Yeah. Oh, From there. Watch out, this. No way. Oh. oh. So you've just lost an account back. That is some shit golf gun. Oh! oh. Yes, <laughs> man! Was that mud? <laughs> <laughs> Imagine if that was sweet or something. Wow. I don't know, you just feel so. Oh, wow, what the f wow, that's showing teeth. How Mate, much are you up by? Tom Violet, eh? Like he, he had a, he had a four-pointer in wrestling. I've gone three, four, three, three, three. 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 You're a birdie. <laughs> 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 I find Toyless Pro V1X is for $8 a dip, and he's going to win playing a 20-cent Brosnan. 12 back, 20 bucks. <laughs> <laughs> you work the rest out. Gryffindor for 60 Sorry. points. Finish on a birdie. No. Oh. I, mean, I had one wash in That's two days. That's almost 30. It's a 34. Oh, in, mate. Oh, go, mate. Well, so that's the win. Pa. Yeah. No, I'm already. I'm no, kicking he ass. Up, I'm up, kicking up, ass. Up. He's wearing it the Mad Killer night. Yeah. Hey, give us your first shot, mate. No. Griffo's probably got more yeah, points this round than I did over the both days. Should not be off 27. Like, he hit every fairway, <laughs> like, hitting straight shots. <laughs> Fucking dick. Don't finish on that. Truth is, more it is. Fuck, he grips down. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. Sure, if you kept talking. Oh, there you oh, go. Yeah, man. It's a four game, really. Hey, oh, good work. Didn't even okay. play with Val. Oh, 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 Last place of the uh, golf comp has to drive bus home roughly five and a half hours to Saturday around lunch time. So it's going to be a bit of a slog and welcome in last place, Chad Townsend. Well done, mate. Thanks, mate. <laughs> Look, you were the hot favourite. You were playing a lot of consistent goal, plus 30 points every time. Just um, wasn't, just one of those weeks, one of those days. That's goal. Couldn't get it going. Yeah, it wasn't my weekend. Uh, you know, I've, I've crumbled. I was coming in as a favourite on the weekend. I haven't lived up to the hype 
and drive is going to hurt. It's hard, but it's um, been a great weekend with the lad. A bit like Willie Pike and a $2 favourite crumbles. Now we're going to go to the presentation. Chatty's going to hand the jacket to the winner. All right, so the results are in. In eighth place, obviously I came last driving the bus home. In seventh place, Cohen Hess. In sixth place, Jack Jetski. In fifth place, Ruben Cotter. In fourth place, Scott Drinkwater. Come on! In third place, Valentine Holmes. In second place, actually, let's go straight to the winner. And the winner of the Port Douglas Open 2023 goes to <laughs> Griffin Neem. Yeah. Get him in here. Well done, mate. Get in there, Griff. It's because of the orange polo. Well done, well done. Here's the jacket. Cheers, mate. Congratulations, Steve. Good time. Give me a hug. Congratulations. Good on your knees for him, Oh, I'm a bit sweaty, eh? Oh, oh my god! No. Alright, Griff and Neem, the inaugural Port Douglas Open winner. Griff, how do you feel at the moment, mate? Yeah, it's one of those feelings. Like, words don't describe how I'm feeling, but yeah, you know, there's a lot of people I could thank today. Yeah, you know, I'd like to thank my family, mum and dad, sisters, you know, a big part of my golf golf career. Um, I'd like to thank 660, the old van they've uh, given us for the weekend. Um, what else can I have? I'd like to thank my um, my buggy partner, Mud did, and he was a real help for my uh, golf time today, and you know, I've shot 43. Burglar, handicap dropping next time? Hey, maybe, maybe no, not. Well done, mate. All right, cheers, thank you. Um, jacket looks good on you. Where are you wearing the jacket tonight? Said that night. <laughs> Going home to sleep in it. Maybe not, I've just played the best golf of my life. <laughs> well done, mate. Congratulations. Thanks, boys. Appreciate it. Righto, folks. Uh, that's a wrap for the uh, Port Douglas Open. Thank you to Palmer C and Mirage Country Club for having us. Good two days, not two good days of golf for a couple of us. Um, but thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.